I know I've brought the dishes up as an issue before, but nothing's changed. And they just keep piling up after you use them and then I have to do them. And I just find it a little disrespectful. I don't want to ruin what we have, Janet. I like... There is no Janet. There is only the great Satan. Great. So, I understand that you got possessed recently and I'm really sorry about that, but I want to work through this, Janet. I don't... There, there is no Janet. There is only the great Satan. I get that. I really do. I just don't get what that has to do with the dishes. The great Satan does not do the dishes. I understand that you're going through something, but back in October when we signed the lease the together... The great Satan did not sign the lease. But Janet did, and... There is no Janet, only the great Satan. You understand where I'm coming from, though, right? Because the dishes keep piling up and it is absolutely filthy in there. The Great Satan is not the only one to use the dishes in this apartment. But I wash the dishes after I use them, so none of those dishes are mine. The mere mortal cannot prove those are the dishes of the Great Satan. There is raw meat and pig's blood all over them, and you know that I'm a vegetarian! The Great Satan does not find your tone to be very helpful. You're right. I'm sorry. How do we work on this together? The great Satan will do the dishes if you sell your soul. No, we talked about this. I'm not. I'm not doing that. I'm not going to sell my soul. Sell your soul. No, Satan. Sell your soul. No, thank you, Satan. If you sell your soul, the great Satan will do the dishes for all of eternity. You'll do the dishes. Yes. For all of eternity. Yes. Promise? <laughs> yes. Guys, thanks for watching the video, and thanks to Funny or Die for featuring us this week. If you want to watch more of my videos, just click this link. Okay, bye. <laughs>